everyone so today before my husband left to go to work he told me he ordered me something and that it should arrive today with UPS in the mail so I received the package earlier today and when I opened the box and opened the wrapper I saw this beautiful palette staring at me so I was super excited he said that he was on I think it's Yahoo and he was checking up on his sports update and they had like this article about this particular palette and they referred to it as the trending palette I think he said so he decided to purchase it for me knowing that I love doing makeup looks and always trying different makeup looks so that was really sweet of him so let me share with you guys the palette that I'm talking about and when I first saw this palette I said to myself I definitely have to purchase this palette but I'm always procrastinating so I am so happy to see this palette right now in my presence so without further ado let me share with you guys the palette that I'm speaking about yes it's the Urban Decay Electric Press Pigment palette and this is such a beautiful palette this look that I did today was using the palette and as you guys can see it's 10 they have like 10 beautiful colors I used eight of these colors to create the look that I'm wearing today so the first color it's revolt then we have gonzo we have slow burn savage what is this fringe and then we have chaos jilted urban freak and trash and then you see it comes with a, a brush it also have a warning at the bottom it says that slow burn, savage, jilted, and urban are not intended for the use around the immediate eye area. And I have some of these colors on my eyes. And when I first applied, I noticed that my nose was a slight bit runny. And after a few seconds, it's just eased up. So bear in mind if you have this palette or in or you are interested in purchasing this palette just be mindful of the you know the warning so with that out of the way this is what the palette looks like this is the packaging really really pretty the colors is so beautiful so it comes with a a mirror I don't want to blind you guys but this side is a huge mirror and then this these are the lovely colors and this is the brush that it comes with let me take this out of it's a double sided brush and then you have this side so it also comes with this is their Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion you get like four samples I actually own the full size in three of these the original the sin and Eden I do not have the anti-age and this is what it comes like so that's really really nice and this is a close-up of the colors so on top you have sin then you have the anti-aging you have original on top and then you have Eden okay so let me swatch these colors for you guys so the first color that I'm going to swatch is revolt which is this color right here and as you guys can see it's really 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 pigmented they are super nice super soft and easy to to blend so this is a swatch of that the next color I'm going to swatch it's gonzo which is the which is the blue let me get a white Gun 
pencil. Swatch down on my hand. Next we have Slow Burn, which is the orange color. Next we have Savage, which is this color right here. So the next one it's French, which is this sort of teal color to the end. Next we have Chaos, which is this color right here. Next we have Jilted, which is this color right here. Next to that we have Urban which is this color right here. Beautiful colors. Next we have Freak, which is this one right here. And last but not least, we have Trash, which is this one right here. So these are all the beautiful colors and as you guys can see they are super pigmented and will really work great with a base and if you want the color to really pop more you can use like a white base underneath. So yeah the colors are nice, soft blendable the only thing that i wish that they did with this palette i wish they had like a black color just in case you wanted to do like a little smoked out look and also if they had like a color for like the brow and the crease that would really make this the perfect palette but i'm not complaining i absolutely love this palette and yeah so if you don't have this palette i would definitely you know I would suggest you get in the palette if you are someone into bright colors. If you are more like into neutrals and you know the toned down look, definitely this will not be a palette that you would like. But if you want to take the chance and 
try you know bright colors and stuff like that i would suggest you go out there and purchase this because i really don't know if this is going to be like in their permanent line or if it's uh you know special edition palette so yeah he also um got me as well this is the urban decay heavy metal glitter liner and this one is in the color what is it metal head and this is what it looks like and i love these i'm actually wearing this in the look that i have today so this is what it looks like really pretty i do own the where is it this one is called what is it midnight cowboy and this one is like the gold and i really love these um liners really pretty so this one is what i'm wearing under my lower lash line and he also got me this is the urban decay 24 7 glide on lip pencil and this one is in the color naked so let me just do a quick swatch with um with this this is what it looks like watch the um the glitter liner for you as well so that's what it looks like really pretty so yes guys that wraps up this quick video and if you like this look i did a tutorial on it so I would be uploading the video next so stay tuned for that if you are interested in how I went about creating this look so once again thanks for viewing hope you guys enjoyed this little video and stay tuned for my upcoming videos bye